It's December, it's another unboxing for Beer 52, and this month's theme is Poland. So, with 10 beers to unbox, let's see what we've got, shall we? Let's get ready to rock. Welcome back to Rocker's Beer Review. Today we're going to be unboxing this month's Beer 52 box. Again, you know, and I say this every month, but it, it only seems like yesterday I was doing an unboxing for Beer 52. They seem to come a little bit earlier every month. I mean, this one, you know, pretty much has, cu has come at the end of November, um, ready to be unboxed today. But I want to get this out, get it out for you to see, see what the beers we've got. Uh, and this month, um, they give me, a, they phoned me up a couple of weeks ago and they said, Rocker, well, they didn't say Rocker because they didn't know me as Rocker, but they said, you know, we know that you enjoy the Beer 52 box. How about we give you two extra beers this month? And I thought, oh, there's, is there a catch here? And I said, no, you can have two extra beers for absolutely nothing. So I've got 10 beers in here instead of eight, and I've paid 24 quid for 10. So that works out, you know, £2.40 a beer. You know, if you even exclude the, the snack or like some, uh, some of my um, viewers have said, well, the magazine has actually got a price of 4 99 on it. I don't think I have to pay 4 99 for the magazine. Anyway, I've dribbled on enough. Let's get this box open because... I want to know what's in it. I'm really interested. I haven't seen the beers. All I know is the theme is Poland. And obviously, because I've got 10, I'm quite excited. So, opening it up. Now, this is interesting. I'm just going to move that out of the way so you can see the beers we come in. I've got an envelope. What's inside? Oh, well, that's nice. I've got a Bert, the Christmas card. Probably my first Christmas card of the year. Happy Christmas. Um, oh, and actually what it is, is it's a Christmas card um, for me to give away to someone uh, to get free free beers. So it's, uh, not only they've sent me a card, it's not actually to me, it's actually to one of my, you know, maybe one of my friends or family. There we go, there's your Christmas present. Free, eight free beers. So let's get, let's see what we've got in here. Wow, well, we've got something a bit different here. The snack looks like a nice big packet. There we go, there's the snack. They're Ollie's Pretzel Thin Salted Original. Oh, I've not had those before. I mean, that looks quite interesting, a bit different than the normal sort of nuts that we get. So there's those. Magazine in here, let's pull that out. So there's the Ferment Magazine for this month. And as I say, the theme on it is Poland. Um, so I expect there's lots of interesting int articles about Polish breweries in here. And of course, at the end, the back of the book, um, as, the, as it is every month, I remember, I'm sure a couple of, when I first got it, they didn't, they weren't doing this every, every month, but it actually has, you can see there, the beers that are in there, bit of description about the brewery, bit of description, some tasting notes, what it's going to taste like. Um, yeah, brilliant. I mean, it really helps me when I, when I, before I read them, I usually have a little read up on that, or I'm just sort of, you know, maybe I'm looking back and seeing what they're like. And first things first, what's interesting is it looks like we've got pretty much We've got eight bottles and two cans in here. So, um, which is quite unusual because usually it's the other way around. So let's get the first one out. So the first one out, I'm going to obviously caveat this uh, this unboxing with the fact that I'm going to try and pronounce some uh, some Polish brewery names. Uh, and, and to be honest, I have trouble pronouncing my own name sometimes in English. So um, this first one is called Attack Chimelu. Attack Chimelu. Uh, nice sort of... It's an American IPA. I think Pinta is the name of the brewery by looks of things. Yeah, Pinta Attack Chimelu is an insanely hot American pale ale, red copper in colour, fully, fully bodied with a bunch of citrus in taste and aroma. Citrus, floral, resinous, piney, fruity. Yeah, it's got a whole thing in it. Yeah, it looks interesting. Obviously, um, po Polish, that's coming in at 6.1%. So, you know, reasonably, reasonably strong. I'll stick that there, make sure that you can see all of them as they come in. I'm just going to move the magazine out of the way there. So I want to make sure that you can see all the beers as I, as I sort of bring them in. So let's check that one out. Next one, Rowing Jack. Oh, that seems to be easy to pronounce. Uh, this is an Indian Palau. This is from Browa. What's the name of the... Hop Heads of Poland. That's is that the name of the brewery? Ale Browa. That's no, that's they're called Ale Browa. Uh, Browa obviously means po is Polish for a brewery. 
But again, yeah, it looks quite good. This is an IPA, and this comes in at, what's the alcohol on this? 6.2%. Yeah, we're off to a good start with these two. Two reasonably sort of, um, reasonably high ABV beers. Beer number three. Again, God, this is getting easy now. Okay, so it's called The Barber. It's a New England IPA, you know, rocker's favourite style. I love that, uh, you know, artwork, sort of like a sort of, yeah, obviously a, a hipster bro, uh, hipster uh, barber on there with a big moustache. Uh, this is by Brokerach. I mean, it's got, I'm not even tempted to say that. Yeah, I mean, it's uh, this is a New England IPA and it's from the bro brewery. I'm going to have one more go at it. Brock Richka. Brock Richka. Uh, and this is coming in at 5.8%. There we go. Nice looking beer there. Um, I do love that when they do the country themes, because especially something like Poland, it's not, you know, it's not, it wouldn't be somewhere that I would, you know, you don't go to your bottle shops and go, oh, can you give me half a dozen Polish beers? It's, they're not that common. So you're going to get some beers that a lot of people probably, you're probably never going to, never really going to try. And that, you know, if anyone is, you know, thinking about Beer 52 um, and thinking, well, whether it's worth a subscription, you know, when you've got when you get the country ones, I think they are the strongest in terms of uh, the themes. The country themes are always, always the strongest um, because you're getting beers that you know you can't really get that that um, from you know from your sort of normal bottle shop um, or even online bottle shops. So beer number four, this is called Misty. This is a contemporary IPA. I'm not really sure what a contemporary IPA actually is. Um, it's five point five percent. It is from the Du, du, du. Trizek Kumpli Bromar Lotney. I think that, I think the, the brewery is called Lotney. So Misty Contemporary IPA. Yeah, that looks uh, that looks pretty good, and, and I expect that to be nice and cloudy. Next one. Okay, we've got a light beer from. God, I can't even pronounce that either. This, oh, this is another ale Bromar. This is Nipkov. Nipkov. Uh, yeah, it's just called a, a light beer, and it's uh, but it's four point six percent. So I'm not quite sure what that is. Clean flavour profile. Uh, I expect that's more like a pilsner then, but we won't know until we open it. And so uh, you know, again, if you if you want to see me review all of these beers, which I'll be reviewing in December, um, then sub like and subscribe for, to the channel, and you'll see me review all these beers and let you know exactly what they what they like. So if you not been a beer, if you're not a beer fifty two subscriber, then uh, you can see the sort of quality. And if you are a beer fifty two subscriber, then you can uh, watch the videos as you drink the beer and sort of say rocker. You're off your rocker. That's not that's not a great beer or rocker. Actually, you know that's that's really nice, but you don't really like it. You know, I, I think it's good to you know you can get other people's opinion. And a lot of my uh, viewers that, that are already subscribers of Beer Fifty Two enjoy that. So number one, two, three, four, five, six. Number six. This is called. This is a double wheat IPA. Yeah, I mean, no one say the wheat beer is my favourite of styles. Um, but this is a double wheat, so it's seven percent, quite strong. Um, yeah, called Pan I Pan. Oh, oh, it's a player. I don't, Pan IPA, Annie. I think that's what it, what it is. And this is uh, this is another. This is from the Bromar Lotney again. So that's the that's the Bromar Lotney. This one was it. Yeah. Yes, yeah, the same as this one. So these two here are the, are the same breweries. Okay, next beer, piece of cake. There we go. And this is a session IPA coming in at six percent. Well, that's quite high for a session IPA. I mean, these uh, Polish drinkers—they must be really hardcore if, if they call it a six percent IPA session. I mean, I've seen some IPAs that aren't session that are less than six percent. This is another Bromar Lotney. So there's uh, there's a few of those. Um, what we got here one two three from the from that brewery um, and then the last the last of the bottles anyway this is a called surfer and this is another wheat bar beer but not it's not a double wheat beer uh, and this comes in at does it actually say this is called bro this is from the brewery Grosschenken wow and that's probably not the right pronunciation either 4.8% this one is. Surfer. 
I mean, I don't know how many, uh, considering that Poland are landlocked, I'm quite surprised that they would they would call one of their beers surfers. So they're, the, they're all the bottles, and then we've got two cans. So, can number one, this is a, a, a daily hazy IPA, or APA, sorry, American Pale Ale. It's 4.8%, uh, Funky Fluid, that's the name of the brewery. Yep, Funky Fluid. Yeah, looks quite good. Hazy hazy American Pale Ale, so we'll stick that one there, for you to see. And then the last of the cans is this one. This is an American Beauty, it's an American Blonde Ale, and quite a striking can. That's 5% ABV. Um, this is from, oh, this is another Bromar Lotney. So we've got, actually got four from the same brewery this month, which, which to be honest, is, is quite rare. Usually you might get two, but very rarely would you get more than that. And most of the time you'd have, you'd have basically Eight, you know, eight beers potentially from um, from each from individual breweries. But obviously, because we got ten, we got a couple of more. So probably that's why there's a there's a few more, you know, from from uh, the same brewery. But you know, again, consistency. So this these two are the same brewery. These three and that one has four of those from the same brewery. But you know, I think there's quite an interesting selection there. I'm looking forward to drinking all of these. Uh, obviously, we're getting into Christmas, we're getting into December, so. Um, you know, there's going to be lots of beer drinks. We're going to do some different things, hopefully, on the channel. There's going to be some different different music stuff. I've all just ordered another box of of beer from the from my from the bottle shop, uh, Craft Metropolis, which I, I use quite a lot. Um, and we've got some interesting stouts. We've got some, uh, you know, we've got some some fruit smoothie. But, IPAs in there. We've got oh, we've got some quite interesting different beers. Not all New England IPAs, although we still have got a few of those. Um, so that's this unboxing for Beer Fifty Two for this month, Poland. So if you, I, I think you know, if you if you see this review and it's still like early December, you could probably get your order in. I will be putting a link. There's a link in the description so you can get twelve uh, eight beers for half price. That's only twelve quid. That includes postage and packing. Uh, so that works out a really good deal. And I, I think this is a good box to just to, to be a good starter if you've not been with Beer Fifty Two before. So hope you enjoyed it. Looking forward to reviewing them all. And until the next one, you know what we're going to do. Keep on rocking.